I will name my firstborn Lodervat. Oh, you know, pr probably not. But... I... I can't believe we're alive. I mean, I, I never want to see somebody's brains come out of their nose. Not ever again. That... That was the single scariest experience of, of my entire life. Which should probably be over by now. But it's not. For some reason. But for those guys... A lot of those guys... It's over now. We made it. I mean, his brains. Just... Just like... Like snot. Yes. Okay, that was awful. I agree. But we got through it, you know, and that probably shouldn't have happened. At least now we know we can handle ourselves. If, if what? If brains ooze out of people's noses? Well, yeah. Basically. I guess you sort of have a point somewhere in there. All right, let's just find this guy, August. Buy the key. And get the hell out of here. Ja. Ich rede nicht so viel in dem Let's Play, wie ihr vielleicht mitbekommen habt, weil das halt besser rüberkommt, wenn halt nicht so viel geredet wird, weil ich finde, das sollte alles gut rüberkommen. Und nicht wie andere Let's Play, die dann da durchgehend labern. Das finde ich nämlich total dumm. Deswegen tue ich das nur an solchen Stellen wie hier. So, was haben wir da? Ein Bullymong. Bali Ballymong? Ugh, does every animal on this planet have to look like a giant monster? Anscheinend schon. Das ist. Das ist doch immer so. Na, ja, gucken wir doch erstmal mit dem Auge. Weil wie uns nämlich schon aufgefallen ist, wir haben ein besonderes Auge, mit dem wir Sachen scannen können. Aha, aha. Aha. Und dann haben wir noch ihn hier. Professor Penumbra. Das erinnert mich gerade, dass ich Penumbra auch mal weitermachen sollte. Kommt bestimmt bald. Alright, you know, the stuffed animals was one thing. But this is taking a turn I really don't want it to. Right this way to the world famous hall of Pandoran luminaries. Come face to face with icons of the planet's turbulent history and hear how each met their grisly fate. Please yeah. watch your step and marvel at some of the unexpected ends of life's grand design. There's nowhere else to go. Come on, let's just get through it. Dann gehen wir mal da lang. Boom, not to be confused with his brother Boom, was the first maid of Captain Flint. As his name subtly implies, Boom enjoyed hurling caustic explosives and making things blow up by any means necessary. Who around here doesn't? Oh, was haben wir denn da? Okay. Gehen wir zum nächsten. Pandoran resident and fine dining connoisseur, Shade, was held in high esteem by his fellow neighbors in Oasis. Not in the least bit insane, he will be missed. I am really not into this at all. Seine Füße sind... Wow. Oh, I remember this guy. He was an asshole. Formerly a scientific researcher who worked for Hyperion, Professor Nakayama was obsessed with cloning Handsome Jack, who he carried a certain fondness for. Killed by stairs! No witty rejoinder? You must be more traumatized than I am. Hey, you still got his Hyperion ID chip. Really? Keep it. Hyperion pays out a nice bonus for recovering those things. Oops. 
So, hat er denn noch was im magischen Auge? Oh ja, mehrere Sachen. Weapon. Neuron linkt Kanone. Okay. Oh yeah, well. Die sieht nicht mehr so stabil aus, auf jeden Fall. Ein verrotteter Arm? Okay. Was haben wir hier? Eine Lady. Die once ruthless leader of the Crimson Lance, Commandant Steele. Her leaderness came to an end when she was skewered by a monstrous tentacle. She later Tentai. died a second time after having been resurrected as some kind of cyborg zombie thing. Can we just get on with this? Lass mal gucken, was hat sie denn da auf dem Kopf? The brain of Commandant Steele. Okay. Oh, it's locked. Oh, come on, are you serious? Well, this feels like we came in the back, so maybe there's a front door somewhere? Yeah, I don't know if we can get out there with the murderers all over the place. Maybe one of those bodies has a key or something and we just missed it. Wow, I mean, if we just randomly found the key, I mean, that would be amazing. Dann schauen wir mal zurück. Ey, da fehlt doch einer. Are you two not just the handsomest devils I've seen in ages? <laughs> Why are you pretending to be dead? <laughs> dead? No, 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 no. Asleep, maybe. Dead. That's your... You're getting ahead of yourself. <laughs> what? 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 What is this? Is this part of the... Like, some kind of ride or something? Since the moment we walked in, it's just been one big freaky puppet show, so Thanks. I... I'm Shade, and this is my world of curiosities. Let me tell you right off the very bat, I am deeply sorry that you strapping young threshers of gentlemen here have to witness it in such sad disrepair. Time can take a toll, you know, and on more things than one. <laughs> <clears throat> But unfortunately, we are closed for renovations. That doesn't mean you have to leave, of course. No. <laughs> I mean, we can do other things. We're looking for a man named August. We're supposed to meet him here. You know anything about that? Oh, sure. Sure. Why didn't you say so? Huh? <laughs> You're late, actually. <clears throat> yeah, we know. Yeah? If you want to buy something strange and illegal, <laughs> this is certainly the place to do it. Lade Bildschirm. My grandpappy. He's the one who came up with this place. He was a real thinker, you know, a real lover of animals. <laughs> Still is actually, because he's definitely not dead. But the place itself. What happened? You get stuck in traffic? You Hyperion guys, you're usually so punctual. Getting 10 million together can't be too much trouble for you guys. Oh, well, excuse me. I, I don't know if you heard the explosions outside, but, you know, we had to mow down about a couple hundred bandits just so we could ring the goddamn doorbell. Just in time for the spring collection. <laughs> yeah, well, that's Pandora for you. If it ain't a friggin' bug stampede, some jerk-off is using you for rocket practice. All right, well, <laughs> I'll just leave you to your business things then. I'm August, but I figure you know that already. Der Mann mit dem Schlüssel. Is, uh, is Vasquez coming? Vasquez? <laughs> He was just the go-between, the middleman. The puppet, the pigeon. Stop. I'm the one who's buying the key. Yeah? Well, I guess as long as you got the money... One Hyperion bootlicker is as good as another. So, what's your name? Just so we're on uh, My equal name footing. Is Rice. It's Reese. 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 Isn't that what I said? Sure. <laughs> Just sit down and let's do this so we can move on with our lives. Oh, 
Okay, so, let's see the money. Cash only for this deal. And I hope you brought big bills. The kind that are hard to break. Uh-uh, no. I know how this works. We see the merchandise first, then you see the money. Yeah. <sighs> all right, all right. The baby wants its bottle. Fine. You ever see anything so pretty in your miserable lives? This thing will practically dance at your wedding. State-of-the-art alien crap. It's goddamn gorgeous. Freaking A right it is. Okay, so... The way I, uh, usually do these things is... Wait! What? I... Oh, I just don't like it. I got a... I got a feeling. What feeling? Look! You said when I started to get a feeling about something that I should tell you and that we should walk away, right? What are you possibly feeling right now? We're almost done! I get intuitions about this stuff. Is she okay? Yeah, yeah, she's just freaking out. She does that sometimes. Sasha, what the hell are you... I just... I just don't like it. They've had this dumb attitude on their dumb faces since the moment they walked in. What are you talking about? And why... why wouldn't they show you the money, huh? What's up with that? Sasha? They've been all... Oh, yes, sir, and oh, no, sir, and oh, I have the money we agreed upon right here. Nothing you're saying is bad. Nobody does that! And especially Hyperion ore monkeys who'd rather bomb a small village than talk things through. I mean, look at that guy. Look at his face. What's wrong with his face? Hey, Sasha? Sasha, listen to me. I, I'm asking you to please trust me on this one. I know you don't trust Hyperion. Yeah. You think? And I know you have zero reason to trust us, but I'm telling you, we are not like those assholes. In fact, we're trying to get back at one of the worst assholes up there, and we need that key to do it. So please, take the money, and let us screw over one of the biggest jerks on Hyperion. Please. So you're saying this key will get used to screw over some wretched Hyperion stooge? That's exactly what we're saying. I'm sold. Awesome. Let's do this. Well, just wait. Just wait. Uh, August, everything's fine now. I mean, I don't know. If you really think... No, no, it's okay. The feeling's gone, August. Let's do the deal. He's Macbury. I don't know. Maybe today's not right for this. If, if, if things are weird... Uh, the bad feeling is gone, August. She said so herself. We still got a deal here. There's no problem. Let's just... No, I'm... I'm sorry, guys. I was... I thought I was gonna deal with Vasquez, and now this, I just... I just think we should call it off until I... I think things are square. Maybe another time, fellas. Hun, we're here. We should just do this. Really. No, I made up my mind. August, wait! Reese, this is your department. Do something! August. Actually, that's okay. Whoa. We don't know it yet. Sound quality scheiße? Know what? That this... This is it. You can't see that one day. Maybe ten years from now. Maybe <clears throat> ten months. Maybe tomorrow. You're gonna think back on right now. And scream to the stars for mercy of death. Just so you'll not have to live in the wondering of what could have been. What if I had seized that chance by the throat? What if I had beaten my fears, taken what was so rightfully mine? What if I had won? <laughs> I am a winner, Reese. I am a winner! What a steaming load of scag crap. 
<laughs> well, look who decided to show her face. I was just about to get to my favorite part. You know, where you come in and you ruin my life, you no-class scheming Pandoran scum! Oh, nice haircut, you lying Hyperion jackass. It is a nice haircut! Oh, shut up! Stop it, stop it! You're getting dirt in my eye! Oh, that sucks, because I'm trying to get it in your lying mouth! Iona. Das bin auch ich. Oh, all right, all right. <coughs> Mission accomplished. <coughs> and I'm not lying, okay? I'm embellishing. And how the hell would you know anyway? You weren't at the deal. Of course I was, you dope. I can't believe you still haven't figured that out. I knew you were dense the moment I... Your turn, Fiona. My turn for what? Tell me your side of the deal. You couldn't have asked me first? You kidnapped me hours ago. I guess I could have. You guess? I've been baking in the sun with Rax dive bombing me for the last. Okay, I get it. This fraud conveniently left out the most important part of this whole thing. Which is. Oh, this ought to be good. No, oh, go on. I can't wait. The vault key shattered. It's mine! Give it! Stop! What's your freaking problem, man? Wait, 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 wait. How is that? The most important thing. Did you forget the part about it all being your fault? Oh, come on, that was not my fault. Not all of it. Are you making a face under there? I can't tell what you're thinking if... Okay, fine. But let me start at the beginning. 